next item here is a discussion of per participate in collaborative community solar for public facilities. Okay, so trustee chairman came up, uh, somehow found this group that would help us with the widget plant. Sure. Um, uh, the Metropolitan Mayor's Caucus, of which Algonquin Township is a member, um, by virtue of us participating in the uh, Greatest Region Compact, were eligible to see whether or not uh, we could pool with other municipalities and other townships uh, to get a, a bulk discount using uh, renewable energy credits. And it's something that uh, is out now a national community solar clearinghouse solutions program and they are working with Commonwealth Edison customers to leverage lower prices and guarantee availability of community solar resources for participating municipalities. It's designed to capitalize on renewable energy opportunities created under the new Illinois Future Energy Jobs Act. And so uh, the vote tonight is just a vote of no, there's no vote. the vote tonight okay. is just a vote of support to contact the organization uh, and say that we are interested in them coming and doing a free uh, audit to see if we would be eligible for the one. Okay, I'm just going to tell you that we already filled up the form, and, and so I understand that, and I'm okay. following up the rest of the way. So um, I'm making a motion that we participate. I'd like a second, please. I'll second it. Any discussion? I just have one quick question. Yeah. Does this apply? You said comment customers. Does this apply uh, to all of our uh, like street lamp accounts that we pay for? Yes. It does. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Any other questions? Okay. Yeah. So our office has already applied, and they're going to get back to us to see if we're eligible. Yes. And it's not a commitment, it's just a no. so you're just asking us to vote. That's right. And vote officially as the board that the board took the action rather than just the supervisor. Okay. All right. Well that's All right. fine. All right. Well, I'm going to share. I agree. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, my experience is that Commonwealth doesn't charge a certain amount and it was a monthly fee for the lights. It was not related to usage. Oh, okay. oh they, no, they do. They do charge per kilowatt. Each yeah. month they send us. Each month they send, yeah. Yeah. One, two, yeah it, how many kilowatts? Yeah. yeah. But they don't have a meter on all those things. Oh, well, they do. Yeah, they do. Three months? Yeah. Every month they send it to us, yeah. Well, they may send you something in based on their uh, situation, uh, estimates or whatever they'll use. But uh, there's no. Well, I now there's a smart meter that, that does it automatically, computerized. Oh, this is well, this is it. The, the good part is Commonwealth Edison is just uh, a, a frame over. They're they're not really involved in this. This is with the uh, new Illinois Jobs Act is where this was sprung from, and the um, the Coalition of Solar Active uh, Corporations are the ones that are uh, helping to roll this out. And so, if there's no further discussion, all those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 At the most, I'm, I'm favoring. <laughs> and the motion carries. Okay.